Marion Tony Trabert was born in Cincinnati, Ohio in 1930. He grew up near a public park which had clay courts. He didn't play on grass until he was 18 years old. In his early 20s, Trabert served for two years in the U.S. Navy. In 1953, he won his first Grand Slam singles title at the U.S. Championships over Vic Satius. At the end of the year, Trabert played in the Davis Cup Challenge round. After retiring, he was a successful U.S. Davis Cup captain. Trabert's going into the net. Something must happen here. The following year, he won the French Championships, beating Art Larson. In 1955, he won the French Championships over Sven Davidson in the final. At Wimbledon, he beat Kurt Nielsen in the final. Victory to Tony Trabert, the first man since Donald Budge in 1938 to go through all seven rounds without losing a set. At the U.S. Championships, Trabert took his third Grand Slam title of the year, beating Ken Rosewall in the final. Trabert then turned professional and lost the 1955-56 World Series to Pancho Gonzalez. He also won the French Pro in 1956 and 1959 and retired in the early 1960s. Trabert was married twice, to Shauna Wood and Vicky Valenti. In the early 1970s, Trabert began working for CBS as one of the main commentators at the US Open and was a key member of their team for over 30 years, commentating with Pat Summerall, on the left, for over 20 of those years. He was known for his analytical approach. Sometimes you came all the way in behind your serve. Other times you came inside the no man's land and waited for the short ball or the deep ball, which you'd volley. I didn't have a favorite surface. I, my attitude was uh, the other guy has to play on the same surface I'm playing on. So I have to adjust my game. Clay, you play a little differently strategically than you would on grass, for example. You have to be a complete player. You have to have you know, be solid in all parts of your game or somebody when they're when you're in that league and you have a weakness they'll find it and they'll take you they'll, they'll you know work on you so i worked hard to be solid in all parts of the game trabit died in 2021 aged 90. thanks for watching Please like and subscribe.